what's up guys welcome back to another video as you guys can see the title of today's video um the evil is gonna get a new exhaust a little more quieter one i'm getting an nvidia q300 it's a little bit um not as loud as this one and um the reason i'm doing that because i will be daily driving my evo meanwhile i get something more chill and low-key for work um so yeah you guys are gonna come along we're gonna go to anaheim to pick up this exhaust off some kid and um i'll be installing it this weekend and i'll give you guys sound clips of this exhaust which is just a straight pipe and then the q300 nvidia if i'm saying it wrong you guys could just let me know in the comment section what it's really called but i i know that oscar had this exhaust so we're gonna install that shit on the weekend and if you guys are interested in my exhaust it's just a straight pipe uh you know slide in my dms or leave a comment down below if you guys are like near the area in cali and yes it'll be up for 100 bucks all right guys so i just finished picking up the exhaust the q300 nvidia whatever there it is, but I ended up picking up something else. I got some OEM Evo headlights because I have like, I guess I have the Lancer ones. These are the ones with the halo eyes. So I might customize them, do like a little halo or whatever, but I'm gonna be slapping these on. They're really good condition. The exhaust is really good condition. So yeah, I'll pick you guys back up on the weekend. So when we get, a, when we get to installing all this shit, can't even talk right now. Today we gonna be installing the NVIDIA Q300 exhaust. I'm gonna be taking off my straight pipe. Uh, pretty simple installation. Just two bolts here, tighten up that bolt, make sure it's on there tight. And um, this is also gonna be a lot more quieter than this, so it's more daily drivable. And I picked it up for a really cheap price. And like I said before, earlier in the video, that this is also gonna be for sale. So if you guys are interested, make sure you DM me or comment down below. If you guys are nearby, I'll, I'll let you guys come pick it up. Yeah, 100 bucks is yours. Actually, before I switch out the exhaust, I want to give you guys a little like sound clip of how it sounds right now. When the, then when I put on this exhaust, the different sounds of it. Let me give you guys a quick little start. -up. So that's how the straight pipe sounds. I'll give you guys a look underneath how it looks. It's just really, all it is is a straight pipe, bro. Like, it's all right, you know? I made 400 on it. I mean, <laughs> instead of spending like a thousand bucks on the ETS Extreme, you could just buy this for a hundred or make your own. This is this is a little more expensive. It's more quiet. So you'll, get, you'll hear a lot more turbo noises with this. My homie Oscar had this on his Evo, it sounded really good. And um, yeah, I can't wait to put it on. And yeah, let's get started. I'm just gonna wait till my car is a little cooled down, but I'm gonna jack it up for now. So I just got the two bolts off. Damn, this gasket is fucked, bro. Look at that shit. I got the two bolts off. Now I just gotta take the hangers that are on, but I don't have any fucking WD-40, so they might be a pain in the ass. It's just two right there. But luckily, luckily the exhaust is a two-piece. It's gonna be really easy. So yeah, let's get into that real quick. Let me just take this bolt off. All right. So it's off. The exhaust is off. This is how the straight pipe looks like. It's just oh shit. I think it has a crack right here. Yeah, I guess there's a cr little crack right there. Mm, yeah, it's pretty shitty welds, but I mean, I made 400 horsepower in it. I mean, all I'm, I mean, if you go to a muffler shop, I'm pretty sure you would pay like, I don't know, 100 something for this 150 or something. Get custom like that. I don't know. I got it for for the low too, and I got tuned with it, and I made 400. So you know, it will be for sale. So if you guys want it, hit me up. Let me put on the new exhaust. It's gonna be a lot easier because it's two-pieced. So 
Let's get to that. Look at that shit. Video. Video, high performance. All right, guys, so the exhaust is on. Looks way better. More tucked, as you guys can see, because those ones poked out a little bit more. I like it more flush. Looks a lot OEM. Got the got everything hooked up. O2 dump. Test pipe. Exhaust. Just gonna drop the car. Give it the first startup. Let's see how it sounds. Alright guys, so this is gonna be the first startup. Alright, let's go. Quiet as fuck, bro. Give it a rev or two. Wait, there's the flame here, Mont. Yeah, huh? No. What? Where? Oh, shit. The fucking miniature flames and shit, huh? Did it? Why? It's too much combustion. That's just black ass smoke, it's running rich. Oh, it is? Yeah. You, see? you don't smell it? It smells hella like it. So I just erased it. Put my little scanner right here. Rev it a couple times. Usually it pops up pretty quick. Um, let's see, I'm gonna just leave it on, let it idle, drop the car. See if it happens, turn it on again and shit. Hopefully it doesn't, but I mean, I I don't see why it would throw a check engine light just because I switched the exhaust. Shit, it's like the same shit. Alright boys, so I fixed it. I don't think the check engine light is coming on anymore. Usually it would have been on by now. It, it usually comes out really, really quick. But this time, yeah, I think I fixed it boys, so we good. So, my overall, what I think about this exhaust, it's really, really, really quiet. And to be honest, I haven't drove the car yet. Um, honestly, I'm supposed to go race somebody today. So I'll make sure make you guys a video for that. I'll probably be racing, I don't know what kind of cars. The homie has some cars, some fast cars. So that'll be in the next video. And I'll get some sound clips. I honestly think this is a way better exhaust than what I have. Like, like I, don't get me wrong, I love the straight pipe. I love how loud, like the Evo sounds super good loud. It sounds like a, to me it sounds like a tractor. But this is a more daily or drivable exhaust where like, I, you know, it's not that loud at idle. And you know, it does have a muffle to it. Maybe when you step on it, you could hear it because I do have an open dump. And um, yeah, I think it's, it's, it's going to be good just to daily drive it. I also have... A catch can that I'm gonna take off of my car for sale. Um, what else? I need to get a new lip because this one's fucked up. I need to get new tires because these are too small. Yeah, so we're good, boys. We're really good. It would have turned on by then because I just checked it right now. I said it had one code, but then I made sure I tightened everything. So the issue was that the O2 sensor was hitting the wall, the test pipe wall, like the test pipe the way that the thing was coming out was diagonal and it was hitting the firewall like the wall on the side where the uh test pipe goes so i put it on the lower one so and then i i just taped it because it was getting smashed and it was in a it, pretty soon it was going to start ripping from all the heat but now it's fixed i might be getting spacers for it because it looks kind of too tuck like that i don't really like it um but honestly i love i love how it looks with the the oem rims you guys leave a comment down below do you guys like it i know a lot of you people do i honestly love the evil like that oh shit yeah i need a i need a new tire asap bro probably gonna go get some new tires this weekend because this shit is ripping yeah so we good boys i hope you guys like this video like comment and subscribe um Hit that bell notification so you guys won't miss any of my videos. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.